In tonight's Healthier Me, whether it's eating out because you can't cook or don't have the time, sometimes going out for your meal can lead to unhealthy choices. Valley News Team's Giovanna Simic tells us how you can eat out without going home feeling guilty. With our hectic schedules, it's a lot easier to eat out than cook at home. But you don't have to give up eating out to eat right. As long as you're being mindful and aware when you're eating, you're going to feel more satisfied. And so even if you select something that is a higher calorie food item, the likelihood is that by being aware of it and enjoying it, you'll still consume fewer calories than by selecting something that was lower initially, but not as satisfying. So how do you dine out and still follow healthy habits? Sanford dietitian Bree Cernsky gave me these tips. Don't skip a meal on the day you're going out to eat because portion control matters. Trying to save those calories, assuming they're doing a good thing, is really just setting up for overeating and again, consuming more than they would have. Cut out or cut back on dressings and sauces. It's helpful in terms of caloric intake, but it also really allows a person to customize how much they really want on there. Be aware of sugary or alcoholic drinks, or what experts call empty calories. Oftentimes the beverages that we choose at restaurants can add up quickly in terms of caloric content, but not really add a whole lot in terms of satiety. So again, not that you can't have those, but just being aware of that. You might not think about this, but ask how your food is prepared. That way, you can leave the restaurant full, happy, and healthy. In Fargo, Giovanna Simic, Valley News Live. And experts say if you do order dessert, it's better to split it with someone or take half of it home. Pretty nice. Yeah. Did Alex Egan really lace up the skates today? He did, and yeah. he did not fall. Really? I was really hoping he'd catch a fall on camera, but he didn't. He's very impressive. Not as impressive as uh, Ben Myers from the Fargo Force, though. He shows us what he has coming up next.